All right, everybody, what's going on? It's been a while. Haven't really done any YouTube videos. I've been very busy with school and work. Um, but today we have a new shipment in. These are ornate box turtles. Uh, scientific name is Terrapine Ornata Ornata. And right now this box contains a group of one male and four females. Um, so 1.4. So let's get to it. As always, you want to make sure that you don't cut too deep in the box, you know, because you never know if they exactly put any insulating and all that. But this right here is not their permanent enclosure. This is like their holding box right now um so it's actually pretty cold in south georgia today for some odd reason yesterday it was pretty hot so um i don't want to risk the animals getting any sort of respiratory infection or anything like that um so please read before i'm packing shipment i'm aware my shipment was delayed um, I was supposed to get my shipment by 1030 as always, but, um, the FedEx delivery driver is actually covering five routes today. So I actually did not get my shipment until 1230. So, you know, it's nothing against her, but I'm just glad that I got the package as soon as I could. And that's all that matters. Um, this is my invoice. I... Um, got these turtles from Snakes at Sunset. Um, I've heard and I've seen mixed reviews about the way they package their animals and the quality and everything else like that. Um, so this is my invoice and this is really the only form of documentation that I have of them. So yes, this is what I need. So Looks good, insulating's good, you know. Um, no heat pack, I believe, so that's all right, I guess. These turtles can take the cold a little bit. Uh, some newspaper, a foreign language. Um, I don't know if it's Chinese, Japanese, um, this knee, that knee, I don't know. So if any of my friends want foreign newspaper, I got you. So, just checking to see the turtles are okay. So I'm just gonna start getting one. Um, they're pretty cold, so. Um, but they are moving, so that's a good thing. So, let me start with this first one. And, oh, safety first. Always safety first before handling any animal. It's very important that you have protective wear. So for me, since they're new to my collection, it's always important to wear gloves. Now, I don't know if these gloves will fit. If they do, it's awesome. If they don't, then we'll just improvise. We're gonna make them fit, you guys. They're fitting. Good, it's good. But um, hope everyone is safe out there. You know, this whole COVID-19 situation. Um, I know it's pretty hard on some people, you know, especially those that are immunocompromised like myself, hashtag type one diabetes. But um, safety first. Always remember new animals require hospitalization. Not really, but quarantine. Um, I normally quarantine my animals for about six weeks until I put them with my other reptiles in my collection. So, this first one that I'm opening up, let's see who you are. And it is, looks female? 
Yeah, it looks, yeah, it's a female. It's actually a really nice female. You know, very alert, clear eyes. You know, one, two, three, four. Yep, all fingernails, toenails are here. So, looks good, looks pretty healthy. Um, love the yellow head on her. So, we're gonna put her down for a minute. So, that's the first one. Now, the second one, don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, but I do know it's a group of 1.4. So, this one's rather heavy. And, you, I, and you, I don't want to handle them too roughly because I don't know if any of them are pregnant or, or gravid. This is a very big female. Okay. Got all the back toes. Got all the front toes. Pretty, pretty clear, pretty alert eyes. All that good stuff. You know, so this is female number two. So I'll put her down. Now for the third turtle. Let's see. Another female. This is the third. Okay. All fingernails, all toenails. Clear eyes, looks very alert. So that's the third female. It's pretty nice. Very healthy. I don't know if I showed y'all the first turtle, but here she is again. Let's see. There we go. This may be the male. This may be the female. Um, this might be one of the yellowhead female that I've seen in the advertisement. So we got two more turtles to go. So we will see how it works out. This is the male. It's a really nice male. Definitely, you can tell because of the concaving on the plaster on. Um, but it's got all toenails, all fingernails. Okay, so what's interesting about the Ornata is that if you look at the male's foot, if I can show you right here. Let's see if I can, yeah, I guess I won't be able to show you. You see that nail right here where my finger is? It actually curves inward. And what that does, it helps the male clasp, clasp on into the female much more proficiently for uh, mating. So this is the male. So, and one more turtle. one's being a little stubborn, but that's okay. I would freak out too if, if a giant hand came into the bag and tried to take me out. Okay, this one's the last female. See, all clear, all good fingernails and toenails. Probably the smallest one I have, but she's a pretty one. So that's her right here. Last female. So this is going to be a very interesting pair. You know, I've never 
seeing a yellow-headed female, ornate, and the male being a yellow head as well. So it's gonna be a, we're gonna have some interesting youngsters in the future, which is my hope to breed these guys. Um, but right now what's obviously most important is that I acclimate them, make sure they have everything. So other than that, they look healthy. I'm gonna get them weighed. I'm going to do some fecal testing on them. Uh, just make sure that they're doing all right. That's the most important part. But um, yeah, this is my first unboxing video for my channel. Um, so if you guys have any questions, any comments, of course, you can always email me, message me, post comments. Um, I'll definitely try to reply as many comments as I can. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So I will see you guys soon.